Alright guys, here we go with War of the Dork versus Legion. This one's pretty out of reach with a level increase right now, uh, but it makes for great content. It's a lot of fun to watch. Some like really big endgame teams, you can see their full potential, what they can do both on the offensive and defensive side. So strap in, let's go enjoy some more fights. So this is the first attack in War of the Dork against Legion, the second biggest alliance in the game now. They've been dethroned by Mutiny. And we're doing a 300k punch up into a... Uh, as a Guardian team, and I'm pretty terrified because this matchup never seems to go good for me. <laughs> it just doesn't seem to work for me the way it works for other people. Um, and we're going to try and change that here today. Now, it's pretty weak Valkyrie, actually. So, we don't want her to die, though, is the thing, right? So I do think we're going to throw all this at Thor. Damn it! I did it again. I don't want to... Maybe we'll throw this at Heimdall. Because I don't want the defense up to get stripped. I wanted a lot more damage than that to come out, though. I'm going to stall. I'm going to stall out here. We're going for turn 2 Icarus Ultimate now. We're going for turn to Icarus Ultimate. I don't think I don't think this will kill the, the Thor. He's so big. This will kill him now though, right? Please kill He's Oh, I thought that death proof was real. Oh my god, I just had a little mini heart attack. I thought that death proof was real on Thor. Scopely, why are you doing this to me? Don't! Why? I just had a little heart attack, man. I have kids. You can't do that with Phantom Buffs anymore. It's rude. <sighs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Okay, well, that worked. That worked. We'll take it. I'm glad I waited to use the ultimate, because I don't think Icarus ultimate would have killed anybody else. We're not messing around here, guys. So, uh, it is Legion. We did pull our Darkhold and our Mamu. To make it simple, to go for the full clear, and that's what I'm going to do. No more talking. This is 70k punch up. This is my dorm hold against their dorm mom, or their Darkhold. Uh, it should be an easy win if I don't screw up. Oh, first screw up already in motion. I don't have Skirmisher on my Morgan. Doesn't matter. We landed it, so we're good. We'll take the mistaken wins all the time. Oh, that's an unfortunate rewind on my uh, Agatha there. Oh, we can get it cleansed at least. I don't think my Agatha... Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think my Agatha is going before that Wong though, which is the, the big annoying part here. But I should still... I should still go before the enemy Morgan. I don't see any reason why I wouldn't. Let's get Dormammu prepped. That'll probably be the last turn he takes. And you know what? Now that we have Striker on Morgan, we're actually going to chew through this team so much faster than we would otherwise. So it kind of pays off. Ooh, his, his Morgan got resisted anyway. Oh, Wong's about to, to tap, tap, tap the enemy Wong. Oh, he must have offense down, because I did nothing. Wong normally smacks. Well, that was okay damage. Can we kill Strange here? Striker Morgan? Coming in clutch? Oh, no. Uh, this is this is a, an arena setup. She doesn't do uh, both adjacent people. Only one. So this is positioned incorrectly. Their mom about to clean up though. And I guess that's a phantom speed up. No, it wasn't. It is now though. I didn't see a resist there, so that's a phantom speed up. Dark hold is so buggy. Oh, I saw the resist there. Never mind. I was just wrong. Just straight up wrong. I'm whining for no reason. 
and I'm 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 gonna allow it. I'm okay with it. I'm allowed to whine. <laughs> All right, good win. Let's keep it going. Uh, okay, so this is attack number three. This is about a 350k punch up into Astonishing X Men. Feels scarier than it is, especially if they put Bishop under stealth, which would be amazing. And they did it put Bishop under stealth. So let's see if we can get this peel off of Beast. We can. We'll see what we can get peeled here. Basically everything. Uh, what does kind of suck though is that Bishop does not have blind or um, or offense down. But that's okay. I mean, I would have preferred to use special there, but we're just not. We're going to flip that defense up to defense. Or defense down, defense up. Big ouchy damage. Uh, let's kill her first. Good. Ouchie. But now that she's gone, now that uh, Jubilee's gone, there's actually not much they could do here. In fact, there's nothing they, because they're just not gonna get speed. Bishop's gone too. Throw it on still on auto now. And here we go. So that's three for three so far against uh, Legion. I'm happy with that. That's a good turnout. Let's keep this uh, winning track rolling. I'm all about winning today. Winning it makes the game so much more fun. So much more fun. All right, here is attack number four, I think, four. Uh, we pull our Young Avengers against them the same way we pull Darkhold. Uh, it's just so that we can clear them. This is a 230k punch-up, and Young Avengers smacks around Wakanda and Crucible. Now, this is in security, though I think we're still fine. We're about to find out. Let's see what Killmonger does. The Killmonger, I believe, he doesn't actually rebound Shane outside of Crucible. Yeah, so we're good. And what you definitely want to do here is you want to take out this Killmonger ASAP. Ooh, defense down too. Beauty. Big punch. That's some good damage. That's probably going to bring the M'Baku taunt around. Yeah, there it is. Can we pull it off right away? Let's see. Nope. Can we kill Black Panther? If we can get... Uh, Okay, that hit. I just need somebody to go just slightly yellow for Squirrel Girl. Oh, never mind. We got it off. All right, there he goes. So we should be okay. Emphasis on should. There is always the timeout factor. Though it's not Crucible, so probably be okay on that front. Unless Miss Marvel dies, of course. Come on, kill this M'Baku! Maybe? Basic does more damage, because no chain. Did not a lot of damage, though. Come on. Yeah, I wanted it for Miss Marvel. Oh, that's not good. Alright, that's good. Get that regen off of him. Go for this M'Baku, just because he's, him and... Him and uh, Shuri going back and forth is crazy not fun. Let's peel all this. And then let's just go for Shuri here. Shuri's bothering me. Oh, and we got the... Okay, that's going to be death. No counters up. Echo hits like a truck. There you go. Dunzo, let's make sure we're targeting defense down. Even though that Equate is about to pop anyway. Bang, bang, bang. Come on, one more hit. Keep your high efficiency points. Yeah, there we go. That's why we pull them. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do uh, Z Factor up against um, Bionic Avengers with, with uh, Drax. Now, it's not boosted, so we should get a lot of crits. Even though he's a skirmish, we should get a couple crits out of our Zemo. Uh, and we should be fine. Famous last words. Hey, there we go. So what we could do is probably kill the Viv. Put ability block on her right away. 
Got a couple nice slows out there. She immediately cleansed the ability block, so clearly I don't know what this kit does. Let's kill uh, Cyborg Buddy. Let's pull them all together. Let's punch Iron Man. Just keep punching them. There's a cleanse. All right, clearly I don't know what these kits do, and it's going to bite me in the butt here, I think. It's basic. Is this unavoidable? No, it's not. Offense up, plus counters. Blind, blind. So the minions definitely ate a lot of the blinds. Ooh! <laughs> I was not ready for that. But Shatterstar took it like a champ. Like an absolute champ. Take the Viv out. Take this out. See if we can't get these buffs off Iron Man. Oh yeah, so that, viv that vision's gonna bleed out now. So yeah, this worked out well. You know what? Shatterstar took no damage from that. That defense up was huge. Let's get some more summons up. And there you go. So yeah, look, the thing about Bionic Avengers is they were great on offense. This is an amazing team. They're so much fun to play in raids, and they're great on offense. They'll beat Marauders, they'll beat Web Warriors, they'll crush Web Warriors. So this is really good news, because they suck on defense. So they're going to solve some problems on offense and free up other teams. Like if you can beat Marauders with these guys, you can use Secret Avengers wherever the heck you want. So I'm, I'm in love with the Bionic Avengers team. I'm so happy to build them up. I'm very happy they're a raid team. All right, here's our next attack. We're going to use Infinity Watch against this Wakanda Surfer team. This is actually great because uh, it's a big punch up and it'll save someone's Young Avengers for something else because Surfer does make it a little bit sketchy. If Surfer decides to ability block uh, your Squirrel Girl, it's it's pretty bad. So, And let's get our dodges up right now. And I'm actually going to go straight at this Surfer. You could go for Black Panther too. Here comes the ability block. It really doesn't matter who it's on because Phyla is just going to cleanse it. Or it'll go on somebody who has the disrupt, right? Or rather the immunity. So either way, you're good. We'll put the ability block on Black Panther so he cannot do his ultimate. And now we go straight for the jugular on this surfer. If that peels that offense or that defense up, it didn't. But if this peels it, yeah. So now what's going to happen is Gamora is going to get the kill on surfer. And she's just going to chain kill here. Uh, we'll go for the basic on Black Panther. This will definitely kill him with offense up. So he's just done. Those bleeds are rough. Ah, let's secure the kill. One more bleed. Good measure. And now let's hit auto so the rest of our teammates can get in there and do some more work. We are in the race right now. We just really want to get their defensive rooms down before they uh, get our armory. And I, they're probably working on our armory right now, given that we've already cleared barracks. So... Or no, we haven't cleared barracks yet. It's got one one more room in it. But uh, anyway, you get the point. It's a race to get the globals done still. Mm, and Baku's a big boy. He a big boy. Oh, he's not that big though. Defense down is killer. So there you go, another good win. Let's keep it going, man. We won a lot today. This feels great. All right, so here we go with the ever classic Dark Hunters Namor versus a full Heroes for Hire. Now, I'm so happy they changed how Morbius' passive works. There's still that one clenching moment, and you know what kind of clenching I'm talking about, if Misty puts the defense down onto Namor. Uh, but because they fixed how Iron Fist can no longer not have blind, they, they changed uh, four blinds into five, it makes this like super easy now, which is great. Um, but you know what has been happening lately is I've not been pushing the Shang-Chi with this ability right here. And no, oh, we did it this time. Perfect. This might peel that taunt off. No, it didn't. That's fine. Hey, there we go. We got the Iron Fist and we got Luke Cage dropping charges. Let's see who missed the attacks right here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
But we got the deflect. I he took it like a champ. Way to go, Namor. I yo, Namor is getting a new skin or something. There's something going on with Namor that has me really excited. And I actually forget what it is. But it kind of indicates that he might be due for a rework, which is like really exciting to me. He's one of my favorite characters. Uh, let's basic here to make sure we ch chew through those death proofs. It's all gravy. Special there. Hey, we got this. All right, another good win. I didn't even look at the punch. I think this was only like a 100k punch up or something. <clears throat> and this is going to be fight number eight. This one is not free. This is a 200k punch up. Uh, it's Black Order against Mercs, but that is a giant 315k surfer. And if he puts ability block on Thanos, it is game over. And I mean it, game over. Rip. End video. Uh, don't show this one, Sable. Don't show this one. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. Uh, thanks, Sable, for making that Black Order footage go poof. Uh, and as always, guys, if you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Stay happy, all the have fun. We'll have new content coming out very soon. See you soon. Bye. And this is going to be fight number eight. This one is not free. This is a 200k punch up. Uh, it's Black Order against Mercs, but that is a giant 315k surfer. And if he puts ability block on Thanos, it is game over. And I mean it, game over. So what I want to try and do maybe is avoid hitting uh, adjacent targets to that Merc Lieutenant and see if I can't somehow... Okay, that's a lot of damage coming in already. Man, he's blinded. Two blinds, that's rough. Well, look, we're going to get the taunt on Cull, which is nice. There's the offense up. This is going to hurt, so for sure... For sure, uh, Proxima's dead. Oh, God. Corvus is dead. I knew this was going to be a risk. Mm -mm. Mm, Cull survived. If that Merc Lieutenant dies... Oh, he didn't die, though. He didn't die, though. Oh! But we got this. We got this. This is a nice turn meter rewind. Oh, come on. No! No, no. Ma, you were supposed to go. Ma hasn't taken his first freaking turn yet. Oh my god, Ma didn't take one single turn. Alright, well, there's our first loss. Yo. No, 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 no. We're, we're keeping Black Rider. We're not sitting letting that stand.